Hey guys, it's Alexis again, and I'm here today, um, fresh out of school, to give my two-week review on the Outre Velvet Remy. And I kind of missed out on the um, the one-week review because I had been making so many videos to tell you guys what I've done to the hair. So I just decided to wait another week and um, just give you guys a two-week review. Today is officially the second week. I got it done um, two Thursdays ago. And that was December 20, um, 29th. And now today is January 12th. So it's been two weeks. And I'm just going to give you guys um, some information about how the hair has been holding up, the maintenance, and everything like that. Okay, so I made a video two weeks ago talking about how I washed the hair. And I just washed the hair again two days ago, so it's only been two washes. And I've washed my hair with the Herbal Essences um, Dangerously Straight Shampoo and the uh, Pantene Moisture Balance Conditioner. So, I do that in the shower or whatever. And um, it's really easy washing. You just wash it, dry it, well just kind of blot it with a towel and then let it air dry. I don't put anything in it after I wash it. I just let it go with the flow okay so um the hair is very very silky uh it's harder to blend your hair with this hair when you first get it because it's just so flat and so straight and so silky but after you start washing it it begins to um go more into its yakky texture um i washed it two times and Again, after washing it a few times, it's able to hold a curl um, easier. So, I curled my hair two days ago. I haven't curled it again. I just put my bonnet on it so I can get these kind of loose waves. And um, it holds a curly real. I, I like that about it. But, I'm going to be completely honest. After the second time of me washing it, this hair tangled. Yeah. Um... I know hair hair is going to tangle. I don't care how much you pay for the hair. I don't care where you got it from where it's supposed to be a, a very high quality type of weave. It's going to tangle. Like, regardless. So it tangles really on the back of my neck. Like I said, every hair is going to tangle on the back of your neck. Regardless of what kind of hair it is. Okay, so it tangles. But... When it comes to shedding, it doesn't shed like how many people say it does. I may pull out, I may do this or whatever. And I may pull out a strand, but other than that, other than like rubbing my hands through it and then four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten strands, no. It's just minimal, very minimal shedding. I like um I like that. So, um what else about it? Um, yeah, it holds a curly well, it does tangle, but very minimal shedding. Uh, I love this hair, just flat out, I just love it. Um, an update with my haircut along with it, you know, when I got it done, I said I didn't get it cut into a specific style, I just got my bangs cut. Well, my mom, uh, she cut my bangs more with, let's see if I have it here. Of course I wouldn't have it when I need it. But she used a razor and she cut my bangs a little shorter so they can blend in better with my real hair. This is my real hair at the top. Right here is my real hair. And then this is weave right here. So she made it to the point where it's able to blend in with my natural hair better. And then right here, with my leave out here, my leave out here is a significant, a significant amount shorter than the hair right here. So, my mom cut some little chunk layers. So, this is my hair right here. And this is the weave. So, pretty much you can't tell it's not my hair. So, right there. So... Um, yeah, so she kind of gave it more definition, and it looks, basically, it looks like it's my hair more now. Now that it's not all one length, just like I'm from the Adams family or something. 
So, um, yeah. And also in the second wash, when I told you it started to tangle a little more, I did put a little bit of cheese silk infusion in it because I thought it would help out with some tangles. And it did. It did help out. So, um, and just be careful for the, um, for the tangling. And, um, one thing you do want to do, which I'm going to have to take up on because I do plan on reusing this hair. Please buy a sulfate-free shampoo or very, very gentle sulfate shampoo because if you use a shampoo that lathers really, like, a lot and it's too strong, you're going to degrade the quality of the hair. See, the hair still flows, it's still shiny and all of that type of stuff, but if I were to use, like, a really harsh shampoo, the hair quality would have went down a great amount. So use a gentle shampoo. Don't use a conditioner that's too heavy. And when you're finished with the conditioner, wash it all out. It's nothing worse than stringy, nappy, greasy looking weave. Especially if you pay a lot of money for it. So, um, again, let's see. Um, I curl my hair with my Eva flat iron. Uh, yeah. I do that and I keep forgetting to make a video on how to do this but when I did my hair when I washed it it was just right after school spur of the moment got in the shower just wanted to get it done with like and plus it was like trial and error and trial and error because I was air drying my hair and I got too impatient so I didn't let my hair dry all the way so I was trying to put curls in it when it was still damp and it was a fail and I wouldn't want to, um, to record that so uh, I'm really planning on giving you guys a video on how to get this hairstyle like I promise I promise I will make one once I get um, my editing system for my uh, camera because I can't edit videos I can't make just one long clip of me curling my hair because it's just going to take too long so I need an editing system for my camera um which is a Canon PowerShot SX200 IS so if you can please help me with anything on how to edit my videos or make it more clips um that would be greatly appreciated and it will be great for you guys because I will be able to make a lot of tutorials a lot so uh yeah see I'm just going to Turn to the back for you guys so you can see the back. It's really nice, really flowy, and shiny. And this is this side right here. And then this side right here. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for right now. Just a little quick two-week review on it. I love this hair. I will purchase this hair again. I plan on reusing this hair that I have in right now. I'll probably take, take it out in um, beginning of March and then let my hair rest for two weeks and then put it back in. So, I will see you guys later. Bye.